dear friends and welcome back to Plants and Lucia. My name is Lucia and today we're going to be making a moss ball for our Monstera. Okay, coming up! Oh, before I forget, if you're watching this video in July of 2020, we're celebrating our first 10,000 subscribers! So, we're doing a giveaway to say thank you. If you would like to participate, make sure to check out the giveaway video so you can have all the info. But now, let's get to our mask bowl. In order to make our mask bowl, we will need our burlap, of course, some bamboo sticks, sphagnum moss, optionally, you can also add coco coir and also optional orchid moss, a spray bottle with water, scissors, and a string or wire. Okay, let's make our moss pull. The first thing that we're gonna do is cut our burlap. So we're gonna do it to the length that we need. I'm gonna leave some of my bamboos uncovered. This is because this is gonna go inside the soil, so we don't need the burlap there and we're going to cut. Okay, so now that we're finished cutting to the length that we need, we can mix our ingredients. Remember, you can use only sphagnum moss for this, but I decided to add coconut coir and some orchid moss. So let's get to mixing. Okay, so now that we have our mix ready, we're gonna place it from the top to the bottom of our moss bowl. And what I like to do is to make a bed for the bamboo sticks. So I'm going to start putting it like so. And then we're going to put our bamboo sticks on top of this, like so. So now that we're finished rolling up our moss ball, we're gonna tie it up with our string. You can use a string or a wire. I'm gonna use this string because I think it does the purpose. And I'm going to start from the top, just to make sure that the moss doesn't come out. So I'll tie it up like this, really tight. And then we're going to tie it at the bottom and then the middle. Once we're done, we're gonna stick the pole to the soil. Remember, this is the part that is uncovered by the burlap. And attach the stems to our pole. Okay my friends, so this is how we make a moss ball for our Monstera and how we can attach our beautiful plant to this beautiful moss ball. Do you have any other ways to make a moss ball or any other questions about this method? Make sure to comment below so we can all learn together. Of course, if you would like to be part of this community, you're always welcome. So make sure to subscribe so we can see each other every week and talk about plants. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Okay, ciao!